hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope everyone is doing well today i'll be sharing how to make stir fry tropical pineapple fried rice it is so delicious and you have to try this to make this pineapple fried rice make sure all your preps are ready once this is done it doesn't take longer at all so as usual i'll begin by introducing all the ingredients we will be needing for this recipe to make this pineapple fried rice, we need a complete ripe pineapple. So over here, we have our chicken already boiled. We have our sweet corn. We have our fried rice spice. We have our blended ginger and garlic. We have our vegetables, which is the carrots, the green beans, and the spring onion. We have our already parboiled rice. We have our liver and our chicken, our shredded chicken. We have our green pepper, that's the bell peppers, yellow and red. We have our green peas. We have our salt. We have our vegetable oil. We have our seasoning cubes. We have our scrambled egg. We have our um, spices, which are the thyme and curry powder so these are all the ingredients we'll be needing like i said earlier one important ingredient you need for this pineapple fried rice is your pineapple because that is what we would be using for the plating it skipped my mind to add it on this table but bear it in mind that we would be needing one now, if you check carefully, you would notice I had already done all the prepping, which means the cooking would not take our time at all. The chicken has been pre-cooked. The vegetables has been cut in, into their various shapes. Everything has been done. The rice has been parboiled. So what we just need is to do the stir frying. Now we have a pot on the cooker. Once it gets hot, we're going to be adding some vegetable oil. Then we allow it get hot as well. Then we go in with some ginger and garlic. And then we give this a good stir for 10 seconds before adding other ingredients. So if you're still watching this video and you haven't clicked on the like and subscribe button, please, this is the right time to do that. Please, please, thank you. Now it's time to add our vegetables. So we're going to be adding all of this into this pan and then we'll give this a good mix for another 20 seconds. And next we'll be introducing the carrots and the green beans. We're going to add this into this mixture and then we stir for about 20 minutes. Now we're going to be adding our curry powder and thyme and then our seasoning cubes after which we give this a good stir. So it's time to add our dark soy sauce. Guys, this dark soy sauce changes the game of your fried rice so ensure you make use of this sauce for your fried rice then we go in with our sweet chili sauce this sweet chili sauce gives our food a little bit of heat i mean we're african so we need that heat in our food now this is the stage where we're supposed to add our pineapple chunks that is the fruit of the pineapple but i feel there is no need because we're going to be using the cone of the pineapple as our plate we'll be using it for plating so automatically the juice of the pineapple still retains inside the food so i feel there's no need but if you're doing yours just do you but the essence of adding the pineapple chunks is for you to have that pineapple taste in it so since we're making use of the corn as our plating automatically the taste of the pineapple still retains inside the food so We'll be adding our parboiled rice at this stage. Make sure you don't overcook your rice so that it doesn't look like a concussion rice. So we're going to give this a good mix and allow it steam for a few seconds. Mm -hmm. 
Time to add our fried rice spice. Make sure you don't add too much of this, just a little quantity and give this a good stir. Then we go in with our chicken and also our scrambled egg. Give this a good stir and allow it to steam for a few seconds. So it's time to add our spring onion. This spring onion is coming last because it does not require much heat. So after adding this, you're going to give this a good stir and allow it to steam for a few seconds. So guys, here comes to the end of this video. Our uh, pineapple fried rice is ready to be eaten. And if you have not subscribed, please hit on the subscribe button and on the notification bell to get notified when I post a new video. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!